In this video, I'll show you how to add emulator shortcuts to Armory Crate on an Asus ROG Ally. All right, my fellow allies, I hope you have been enjoying the Asus ROG Ally as much as I have. This thing has just been a very capable emulation device as well as just a fun little handheld PC. Now, one of the main features of the Asus ROG Ally is its Armory Crate software, which allows you to launch games that you've installed directly from a nice front end. And this does extend to emulators if you so choose. So in this video, we're just gonna take a quick minute to show you how to add them to Armory Crate. So let's go ahead and dive in. So first things first, you obviously need an Asus ROG Ally or I guess any other Asus laptop, tablet, Windows tablet will also work because they all come with Armory Crate. But the only prerequisites is getting emulators installed. So I have a bunch of emulators set up in my OneDrive, in my LaunchBox folder. So I just have quite a few ready to go. Now to get these added to Armory Crate, just press the Armory Crate button on your Asus ROG Ally to bring it up. And in the game library section here, we're just gonna Scroll on over to the add button and press A on the controller. And this will list every executable it can find in your Asus ROG Ally. So things like Dolphin, let's go ahead and add that. RetroArch, RPCS3, Simu, XMU, Zinnia Canary, Yuzu. And for the heck of it, I'm gonna throw big box mode in there as well for my launch box. And once that's finished, you can just press Y for done. And it will add all of those in for you. And there we go. All of our emulator shortcuts added in as well as my big box front end. So if for whatever reason you go into your game library, you click on add and not everything's showing up, make sure that you press that X button to do a scan. So that way it'll scan any additional executables that may have been added. And that way you can easily find them all. And if for whatever reason it still doesn't find all of your executables, that's okay because now you can just press the left or right bumper on your ROG Ally here and navigate manually to where you have your shortcuts placed. So for example, I'm gonna add in my Citra launcher here. So that's just over in my 3DS folder. And we're just gonna grab the Citra QT shortcut right there. Perfect. Now I'm just gonna press Y to be done and it'll get that added in as well. And once your executables are added into Armory Crate, you can just launch them like any other executable. So let's load up some original Xbox emulation here because heck yes. And there we go, OG Xbox emulation booting right up from within Armory Crate. Just absolutely fantastic, I'm a fan. Of course you can make executables per game on a per game basis, but that's more involved than I want this video to be. This is just meant to be a quick emulator launcher. So there we go. So thank you so much for watching today's video and I hope it helps you get all of your emulators added to Armory Crate with ease. But here at the end, I do have a couple of big favors to ask. If you haven't done so already, please be sure to hit that like dislike button, depending on how much you like today's tutorial, as well as that sub button and notification bell so you can see when new videos go live on the channel. Loads of content always coming your way and I'd love to have each and every one of you along for the ride. For anyone interested in further helping support the channel and keeping this content coming, be sure to hit that Patreon link in the bottom right hand corner of your screen or the join button here on YouTube. Little goes a long way to keeping this place up and running and bringing you all of this content. Loads more to cover about the Asus ROG Ally and I cannot wait to do so. Big shout out to all of our current champions. Thank you again so much for always believing what we do here and helping us keep it going for so long. You are just all incredible. Thank you so much. But until next time, my wonderful internet peeps, you all stay awesome, keep on gaming, and we'll see you back next video.